welcome to Storytime with Burley. Today we are reading Who Wakes Rooster by Claire Hodgson Meeker. Who Wakes Rooster by Claire Hodgson Meeker. It should be morning, but it's eerie dark. Everything is quiet, too quiet. Bounce isn't barking. Where is Bounce? Dozing in his doghouse, peacefully dreaming because Miranda isn't meowing. Where is Miranda? Purring in her pillow on the back porch swing because Norman isn't neighing. Where is Norman? Poised in the pasture perfectly still because Pugs isn't snorting. Where is Pugs? Stretched out in the straw next to his trough because Molly isn't mooing. Where is Molly? Snoozing in her stall with her tail sweeping because Pa isn't milking. Where is Pa? Bundled in his blanket because there's no smell of toast and tea. Where is the smell of toast and tea? There is no smell of toast and tea because mother isn't cooking. Where is mother? Snuggled in her soft sheets because Rooster isn't crowing. Where is Rooster? Tucked in his tail feathers fast asleep because the sun isn't shining. Where, oh where is the sun? There it is, trapped behind thick dark clouds. Hurry sun, Wave those clouds away with your golden arms and let the morning come. I think that's the sun right there trying to peek through the clouds. The sun shines and rooster crows. Can anybody tell me how a rooster crows? What sound does it make? That's right, that's a pretty good rooster crow. The tea kettle whistles as mother makes toast. Pa flings off his blanket and flies to the barn. Molly moves and her milk begins to flow. Pugs gives a snort and gobbles his slop. Norman neighs and trots to his feed pail. Miranda stretches and meows for milk. Bounce barks and no one is quiet. But me, I let mother think that her kisses wake me. The end. That concludes our reading of Who Wakes Rooster by Claire Hodgson Meeker. Thank you for watching Storytime with Burley. Please like this video and subscribe to my channel, At Home with Burley. Thank you. Bye.